Welcome back to my channel. We're going to do some morning routine. Yes, morning routine here together. <laughs> so yeah, today already been a kind of hectic day. I didn't have the chance to do my morning routine yet. So it's the time. So anyway, guys, my skin has been incredibly dry so i am planning to do extra step which i will not normally not do but at least it gives me the chance to massage my face so this is only for the days when my skin is uh dry my skin is not dehydrated that is there is a big difference between dehydrated skin and dry skin my skin is dry because of uh, this little friend if you watch my instagram you know i got new retinol i used it once it's supposed to be 0.5 <laughs> strength um not sure about it feels kind of strong anyway guys so i'm going to use my osea um day glow face oil just to unify the skin because i don't know what's going on this is not normal do you see how it feels like it's the retinol this is like not normal and i feel really bad tightness here so i cannot use oils on my i mean keep oils on my face all day long because it just doesn't work for my skin but the only one i can use even i will wash it off <laughs> is this from osea guys so this is just really very unusual morning routine part because I will not do this ever. Um, should I wash my hands before I touch my face? But my hair is clean. I washed it. <laughs> I washed it. So I'm just going to massage a little bit of this oil to my face. Oh my god, it kind of feels good. It feels actually really good. So this oil, guys, has uh, algae argan oil maybe some algae too <laughs> argan oil argan oil is incredible if you have extremely dry skin and you need something to you know just prevent you saw what you just saw right like don't forget dry skin is different than dehydrated skin yes dry skin is from product environment it's something which comes and go dehydrated skin is from within of your body it means you don't drink enough water you need to put some electrolytes to your water and keep yourself hydrated anyway so yeah this is just like extra step to do guys i cannot keep this on my face all day long oh could i no <laughs> this just doesn't work with biological combination it just doesn't work i tried it once before and once I put like my serum on and vitamin C, the oil just didn't go in. Maybe if this is the only product, you know. Anyway. Anyway guys, welcome back to my channel as I mentioned. Today it's a AM routine, but this is a step which I don't usually do. This is really just today because my skin is so tight. Uh, I washed my face already once today very gently actually no i didn't wash my face i did not wash my face i just washed my eyes previously today because i was like running around a little bit i didn't i had to do some things um today is a busy day chiropractor storage <laughs> alias wars because I'm going to pick up some winter clothes with my husband for our trip which is coming soon and uh, then I have to steam the clothes. <sighs> Horrible. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, this is kind of feeling good. How am I supposed to leave this on long? How long is enough for my type of skin? How long? Anyway, guys, so if you're looking for oil for your face, this is from Osea. I miss this in Europe so much. I think they actually do ship in Europe to Europe. But I think it came up to like $50 for a shipment, so I never got it because I was just like, no. And I still had a little bit. So they have this large size, which comes with pump, and they had like a small, tiny one, which has a rolling 
thing on it's like the old school lip balms you know with the roll on oils lip oils <laughs> so I used to have that one it lasted forever this is lasting forever as well you don't need much of it as you can see like my skin is like feeling so calmed right now but anyway guys um I have been struggling with Melia's right in like the eye line part of my eyes bottom and the top lately so what I as well did the other day and it's something you can do but I'm not going to recommend you to do it because it's not for everyone I do it because I do it for a while I test it it doesn't really irritate me unless I do it too much <laughs> so what I do I put a little q-tip to uh, very gentle retinol yes the lightest version of retinol and I just like completely soak it completely like soak it enough and I just apply it like to the areas over I had the milia and once a week and the milia disappears so because I'm not going to doctor to have it like cut off or froze or burnt like hell no you know so I googled it on internet and they said you know you can do <laughs> and I decided to put it to my eye <laughs> not recommended let me know in the comments below if you guys do this too because I don't want to be the only one <laughs> anyway guys so I'm going to wash this all off now because I am already starting to feel how my face is fighting it because my face doesn't love oil to keep it on like I could not put makeup on and not to look like a butter so I'm going to wash my face and uh, to remove the oil yeah as well I have this uh, little sample from Schulz Chasseau <laughs> which is actually good to remove like oil from your face so I'm going to use that just very little bit uh, I use more than I wanted but usually guys my morning routine I put one drop of this on my face I could have actually done that I like massage it to my face and do like gua sha with it which is the VIP O2 from Biological Research. We know it, no? Creating foam. Well, my face is wet. Um, I am just going to use Creo sticks because I don't know what's going on. <laughs> but I had one half of cocktail yesterday. The hair looks funny, you no? Know? okay i had half of cocktail yesterday guys and i woke up today puffy like um i don't know is there any creature which looks puffy so this is so cold i had it in the freezer so it's been over frozen i love this i love this i love this i love this but i'm not mentally ready for this in the morning You know, just to awaken the skin and possible inflammation because cold is good for inflammation, right? So <laughs> I've been cooling my back so much these days because of uh, back pain. It's been like proven <laughs> big help for me, especially like after chiropractor visit or when I lift weights. So cold is good. It just feels weird on the face. Oh my goodness. So and I do it with the water on my face so it slides easy because when they get frozen like this you know there's liquid in it so it keeps frozen for longer you can hear it it's frozen it has like pieces of ice probably um, so it, the water allows it to slide otherwise it sticks to your face and I don't want to burn my face with it so water is good I know there is like products which is like frozen hyaluronic acid and things like that. I've seen it on internet and a friend of mine sent it to me. She's like, oh, this must be great. I would love that to be great. I just don't know how hyaluronic acid acts if you freeze it, you know. It, and it's like a little, it looks like Oreo. And you massage with the frozen Oreo <laughs> hyaluronic acid and other vitamins in it, your face. But how it works all together and how it works when it's frozen those are always the things when i see like when they are like this innovation on the internet you know do i look vacant do i look like i have slept 
I did sleep quite nicely, but the cocktail really didn't work for my health. So yeah, I think skin is feeling refreshed in some level, for sure. And you see like the rosiness on the cheeks. It almost looks like I have makeup on or like I have filter. I don't have any of that. No filter, no makeup. So, no Botox. No, but I'm going, I think next month I'm going guys. And I will do 11 here. Actually the triangle more than just 11 because I do this now when I work out. And as well, I want to do here and here just to lift up a little bit here, you know, like, you know, that's what I do. That's the only Botox I do. Anyway, so my ultimate first step after you wash your face forever is so placenta. Guys, this is for me must have, must, must, must. If you have dry skin, if you have oily skin, if you have acne, if you have problematic skin, if you have dehydrated skin, it's a must have. I know a lot of you dislike it because it's changed, it's not as good as it used to be. I agree, it's not, but it's still pretty good. So for me, this is like the prep product for everything else to come. It just keeps the skin like, it really is like a primer for me for the skincare. I don't know how else to explain it to you. It's great for pigmentation, for healing, everything you picked or things like that. As you see, I picked something here. I had here, I had here, I had here. My period was brutal this month. I can tell you that. I think it's because of the hormones and everything I mentioned in the previous video. And I broke up like crazy. So I did microneedling a few days ago as well. Not a few days ago, like five days ago. My skin like completely refreshed and healed, like the spots are like lightening. This one is still in the process, but there is still something which needs to be gone. I can see it, but it's deep in the skin. Annoying. My dear friends, I had this uh, Barbara Stone Hyaluronic Acid. Um, I'm not impressed, honestly. It kind of... Uh, doesn't seem as it works as the skin ceuticals. So with the skin ceutical hyaluronic acid, it's kind of, uh, kind of, oh, wash machine, I'll be back. I'm back. <laughs> so with the skin ceuticals hyaluronic acid is proven that the absorption of the product of the molecules of the HA goes to your skin. Um, there's many hyaluronic acids on the market but they don't have the proof of the absorption, you know, that your skin would allow it to penetrate to your skin. So that's why I love skin ceuticals because they have like the study, it's a science behind it, you know? So should I put something else on? No, because this is really what I usually do and I want to show you like my, as close as possible to my routine. So my favorite on the world, Vitamin C E Serum must have from Skin Ceutical for me as well. And this one is for the combination, the, no, this one is for the... <laughs> do, 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 do. I believe this is for, not for oily skin, I think it's for like dry skin or sensitive skin. Guys, my dear friends, I as well tried this uh, active serum, broke me out. This as well were part of this. It was immediate, like I put it on at night, breaking out. As well, I tried this uh, from Is Clinical, the C Serum, which is the Pro Heal or not the Pro Healing Advanced, whatever is the name exactly. It's all right, it's all right. I am not gonna be was wasting my money on it because I love this. So I think once you find something, what works for you? Oops, stick to it, you know, just stick to it. You don't have to hunt the trends just because there is girls on TikTok, I don't know, putting eggnog on their face. I'm, I'm making that stuff up right now. You don't have to follow what everybody else is doing because everybody else has their, has their own skin. So once you find something that works for you, like for me, I have my favorites now forever and I try to keep my routine as simple as possible. I think. <laughs> so 
for me it's very important to stick to my routine so I don't spend like days in front of you know the mirror I want to live my life too you know so <laughs> yeah the smell of the salami at this point doesn't bother me <laughs> or whatever it is smoked meat <laughs> It just kind of gets scent, but honestly, it doesn't really bother me. And it really makes my skin like prep for the sun. Vitamin C in the morning, extremely important, guys, extremely important. I'm going to put this one on my neck and my decollet, just so you know. I'm not wasting any samples. This is not the house of waste, just so you know, my dear friends. Be don't waste here. So, um, absolutely no waste product here. Even if I don't like it. <laughs> I will still use this, but probably not on my face. I will probably use it on like my arms, you know, <laughs> or my back, like upper here. As well the skin here, like up here, is very important to, to take care of, guys. I actually sometimes apply retinol there as well, just so you know. Not all the time, because I live in Miami. And my forever favorite, Biologique Research. There we go. Iso Placenta. I as well love the elastin, but I still have the Isu Placenta. Keep buying it on repeat. Uh, why? Because of all the benefits it has. Vitamin C, healing, all the good stuff, you know. I just love it, guys. I just love how it makes my skin feel. It's as well anti-aging. So if you, you know, want something there and you don't want to spend hundreds of dollars on face cream, this is fantastic face cream to have. I think it's for all age as well. Like you can be 20, you can be 18, 17. If you have acne, it helps you to, you know, to heal as well because the placenta in it, even it's botanical placenta, they just did the same, what they do in biological research, they create the closest possible way to the placenta they were using in the past. And you know, now it's magic. So anyway, as I have that happening, I'm just going gently, guys, to massage a little bit of gua sha to my face because why not? I as well used um, my current yesterday, so that could be as well a reason of the dryness. So it maybe is not just the retinol, you know. My current sometimes gets my skin a little dry, guys, just so you know. It's as well as great if you have like very active acne on your face. Um, I just hold the microcurrent on it and it kind of kills the bacteria in it like really fast. So just so you know, works for me at least. And I actually read that on internet and I as well heard people who work in skincare industry to speak about it many times and works for me and if it works for me it should work for many of us you know i'm 39 year old woman i had no idea that in my age today i still will be worrying about breaking out you know the good thing is i use minimum of makeup these days guys like barely any foundation and if I use foundation, I use the one from Chantecaille, which doesn't clog my pores and doesn't create acne. I love Armani as well, which is very good. And yeah, that's about it. <laughs> no, I'm, I have very sensitive skin, you know. I'm not saying other products are bad, but they just don't work for me. Um, yeah. As well, guys, I still don't have eye cream, as you notice, I didn't use any, but I put the placenta around. It works, it works, it works. Um, I do have a little bit of dark circles since I stopped using eye cream, so I test it, doesn't work for me, I need eye cream. <laughs> In my opinion, it's kind of thing which is important to have. I also like to massage like these neck muscles because, guys, you know what happened to me the other day? Jesus, that was crazy. So I've been trying to sleep on my neck as much as possible. 
So, and one day I just really did. I put like this big pillow under my legs and I slept all night. I locked my jaw. I woke up and I could not open my mouth. I was like, like this was maximum. So I did like, I Google it and you have to do like, you know, like you push your jaw forward, you wiggle to the sides and it got better. It got like, that was my ankle, sorry. <laughs> it got loose, but for like two days I was like worried. I love this. So I as well like to use, this is from Joanna Czech. She's Polish, she's not Czech. <laughs> I had a friend who will not buy her products or from her website just because he thought she was Czech. And I, and I told him she's actually Polish, she's from your country. He's like, oh, no friends anymore because if you don't support my existent country, no, it's not if, if you don't support, if it bothers you so much, you know, then why are you even friend with me if, if my nationality bothers you? So, friends like that are not real friends. I love this, I love this, I love this tool. I forgot I had it. <laughs> really, for now. And now I use it so much. I'm getting older, my dear friends, you know? I'm trying to do it naturally as possible, like without extreme fillers or too much Botox. I haven't had Botox since, when was it, January, February? And as you know, probably, because you watch my videos, right? Because you're subscribed and you have notifications on, notifications on. So I hated it, so I broke it with my currency, worked. Amazing. If you don't like your Botox, I highly recommend you to use microcurrency. It really makes the muscles wake up. So, yeah. And the last but not least important. Not the last, actually. Kidding. <laughs> I do, I do step in between these days, guys, because, you know, I'm, I am, why am I shaking this? You're not supposed to shake this. So, I do a little bit of eye drops these days. I am not very good with eye drops. <laughs> um, I always forget. Don't like what that happened, but I can always add later, right? It is what it is. And my dear friends, SPF. Welcome to my life. <laughs> I always use SPF. I've been using SPF every day, every single day. If I'm on the beach, I apply more. I apply like, actually for the beach, I have guys the, the stick as well, which is innovation of the century, I would say. <laughs> Did I apply too much? Probably. So yeah, I could have applied face cream on my neck though. It's okay. Slide all your products down your neck. <laughs> that is as well something I need to be better with because I do it, but mostly only at night. I don't know why, but at least I remember always with the skin, with the C serum, you know? So as you could notice, my SPF is tinted, guys. I have as well one which is super white. Makes me look technically blue. So I don't want to be a smurf, you know. Lip balm. Cannot live without lip balms. This one is still the one from Cheval Blanc. I love it. They have amazing lip balms there. So. Yes, guys, so this is my morning routine. It was a very nice chatting with you, by the way. I really enjoyed this. Um, it's been a while since I did, I think, morning routine. I did PM routine, but you guys always ask for both. So this is it. This is my morning routine, and I'm going to have all my supplements, and yeah, it's gonna be a busy day. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this routine, and I see you next week. Bye-bye.